So first up, before I go, I definitely need some coffee. Here's my Keurig. I use it every day. I'm gonna use this Universal Orlando Resort mug from Starbucks. It's like the been there places. It's adorable. I wish it had some Harry Potter on it. I'm surprised that it doesn't have anything Harry Potter related, but it's still beautiful and I love it. It's blue on the inside. And it's gonna remind me of Universal Orlando and Islands every single day when I drink out of it. So it's just perfection. Look how fun. We have Islands of Adventure, Kong, the Riptide Rocket, which I absolutely love this ride. What are some other fun ones? We have Volcano Bay, which is great, Universal. So I'm gonna have coffee. I always use the biggest cup. I'm gonna be putting Tim Hortons coffee in a Starbucks mug because that's that's how I operate. <laughs> but yeah, let's go to the montage of me making coffee. Always gotta go with the biggest cup. Am I right? Hello and good morning friends. Today is, what is today? Today is Thursday, May 20th. I woke up and I thought, I really wanna to go to the bookstore. I haven't been book shopping or have gone to the bookstore in a very, very long time. I thought, why not make a vlog out of it? I would love to take you all with me. These are some of my favorite videos to watch on BookTube is going to the bookstore and shopping with everybody. So I hope that you enjoy this vlog and come into the bookstore with me. Let me know if you do like these types of vlogs and I will definitely do more if my bank account lets me. <laughs> I'm trying to get only one book today, but I feel like us readers always say that and then we end up walking out of the bookstore with like 10. I'm really trying to just get one and I have quite a few books that I've been wanting and had my eye on and I'm just gonna let the bookstore atmosphere take me in and decide for me whichever one that I'm in the mood for when I'm walking through the bookstore, so we'll see. I'm to go to the bookstore and I hope that you enjoy this vlog with me. So I never really do these, but I also never do vlogs. So I figured, why not do this outfit of the day? So the shirt is Harry Potter themed and it's, I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. And I got this from Kohl's, I believe, a couple years back. And then these shorts I am in love with. They're super cute. They have this side zipper on them that I really love. I am in love with them. I got them from Plato's Closet for super cheap. Also to go with my outfit is my new blue Crocs. Cracks are super comfortable. If you don't have a pair yet, I highly recommend. They come in a lot of different colors. They're kind of pricey, but they're so worth it and they last. I always laugh when I see that in vlogs because you literally have to put your camera inside your car and then leave your car to then get back into it. But I always think it's such a fun thing in vlogs, so hope you enjoy. I think I'm gonna plan to read outside today because it's super nice out. It's like 86 degrees, which is amazing.
so back home from Barnes and Noble, I ended up getting two things when I was there. So the first thing that I got that I could not resist because it was on sale and it was super cheap and I've always wanted this Funko Pop and it is the Harry Potter Funko. It was only $3. It was on sale. They had this one and two other Funkos that were on sale for $3. I almost got all three but I was like, you know what, I just need one right now and I have been wanting this one. so. Styles is super interested in what this is. It's, it's a Funko Bud. So I can't wait to add this one to my collection, but yeah, this is. And then the book that I ended up getting was this one, which is shipped by Angie Hockman. I saw this book in Target a couple weeks ago and I was gonna pick it up and then I ended up just putting it down and I've regretted it every day since. <laughs> So when I saw it in Barnes and Noble, I was like, you know what? I just need to pick it up. I can't say that I only bought one book. Technically, I went in there originally for the book From Blood and Ash by Jennifer L. Armentrout, and they only had the hardcover and it was $31. So I was like, ooh, not right now. <laughs> so then I ended up ordering it off of Amazon, getting the paperback, and it was only like $16. Technically got two books, but I only bought one at Barnes and Noble, and then I bought one on Amazon. So that book will be in in a couple days and i'm very excited for that again shipped by angie hackman like i absolutely love the cover of this and second of all it just sounds absolutely adorable so to read the back a little bit if you haven't heard of shipped yet the unhoneymooners meets the hating game in this clever romantic comedy following a marketing manager who's forced to go on a cruise with her arch nemesis when they're up for the same promotion between classes for her MBA and her job on a cruise line, marketing manager Henley Evans barely has time for herself. When she's shortlisted for her dream promotion, all her sacrifices finally seem worth it. The only problem? Graham Crawford Collins, the off-site social media manager and the bane of her existence, is also up for the promotion. Although they've never met in person, their epic email battles are the stuff of legend. Their boss tasks each of them with drafting a proposal on boosting bookings in the Galapagos best proposal wins the promotion. There's just one catch. They have to go on a company cruise to the Galapagos Islands together. But when they meet on the ship, Henley is shocked to discover that Graham is nothing like she imagined. And soon, the line between liking and loathing is thinner than a postcard. With her career dreams in sight and a growing attraction to the competition, Henley begins questioning her life choices because what's the point of working all the time if you never actually live? This sounds 100% right up my alley and I'm so excited to read this. I think I'm gonna do a reading vlog with it and read it very soon because I'm in the mood for one of these books and I think this is gonna be predicting a five-star read, but we'll see. So definitely stay tuned for a reading vlog of this one. If you'd like to see a reading vlog, let me know down below. Thank you so very much for watching today's uh, come to the bookstore shopping with me. I hope that you enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you very soon. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a magical, wonderful day and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.